Hola, hola. Hi, everybody. Welcome to my new Facebook group, Yolas Cocina. Once again, I really appreciate each and every one of you for all the support that I have gotten within two days. God is great. Um, I'm really enjoying this. I'm so excited to tell you about my surprise. It's a surprise for me and it's exciting for me. Um, so I'm just still trying to figure out how I add groups on here because I still don't know how to do that. So anyway, so here we are. And um, like I said, what we're doing today is, can you guys um, take the dog that way, please? All right. You can't hear me? I'm so loud. I'm like the loudest one ever. I'm beyond loud, you guys. You can't hear me? Can you hear me now? Hello, hello. Can you hear me? Good? Okay. So, today we're going to marinate carne asada. Because as we all know, tomorrow is Cinco de Mayo. Yay! But of course we know this year, our Cinco de Mayo is going to be totally, totally different. So, you know, we all can't gather together, go to the bar, have a tequila shot with each other. Um, as much as we want to, we're gonna have to do it in our own little quarantine world and safely at home. So for those of you, I'm gonna wait a couple of more people to come on um, to tell them about the surprise. Um, if you haven't already known, um, I also posted it already. Um, I posted our flyer. Um, so anyway, so tomorrow, Cinco de Mayo. So you know, like I said, this year is gonna be totally different and we are going down in history, you guys. This is gonna be our first time ever not able to go out and celebrate our victory um, uh, for Cinco de Mayo. So um, unfortunately, we're gonna have to make the best of it. But let me tell you, if you stay tuned with me tomorrow um, and follow um, in what it's on the flyer, which I'm gonna let a little couple of more people come on, um, you will enjoy yourself, believe it, you will. So anyway, um, so I'm just waiting for a couple of more people to get on. I'm trying to share it. How did, does anybody know how to share these things? I'm trying to share it with the group with, oh, okay, 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 here we go. Let's see. Sorry, sorry, just a minute. Oh, I don't know. I don't know why it's not sharing it, but whatever. Um, 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 um. Uh, let's see. I don't know. I don't know how to share it with other people. So anyway, so let me just real quick say it in Spanish for all my Latina viewers. So, buenas tardes, buenas tardes. Gracias a todos. Um, este ya es mi página nueva. Este, el grupo um, nuevo en Facebook. Y hoy vamos a manina, mani, marinar carne asada. Porque ya sabemos que mañana es 5 de mayo. Y este año... Este, nuestro 5 de mayo celebración va a ser totalmente diferente. Estamos impuestos a salir al, a la barra la más cercana a, a tomarnos unos traguitos o estarnos en fiesta con la familia y todo. Pero este año va a ser totalmente diferente. Así es que estamos esperando que llegue poquita más gente para decirles la sorpresa que les iba a decir. So, Eh, ya que estamos esperando, vamos a comenzar. So, aquí compré, I bought two pounds of um, carne asada. Thank you, Vicente. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. I thought I was on that page, to be honest. Oh, wait a minute. Am I not? Is it under? Let me see. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, my gosh, you guys. You know, this is like my, oh my gosh, I'm a mess. I'm an absolute mess. So let me see. Did I go live on that or did I go live on? No, no, I'm live on the Cocina page. So share it, please, Comadre Yeoli, share it with my page, please. I appreciate it. Okay, 
So for those who you for those of you who are just now tuning in, once again I want to show my appreciation. I have been enjoying this time even though it has I'm going to be honest, stressed me out and kind of had me on the anxiety side, but since I've been doing our um our live recipes I've been enjoying it and I'm loving every moment of it. I hope you guys are also. I want to continue to do this. Like I told you guys before, this all started in quarantine and I want to continue to do this. So, los que apenas están entrando, muchísimas gracias de vuelta. Uh, muchísimas gracias por su apoyo. Este, aquí estamos. Todo esto comenzó por la corona y este, aquí estamos y gracias por su apoyo. Si me siguen apoyando, voy a seguir. Primeramente Dios. Um, so, here we go. So the surprise is, for those of you that do not know and have not heard anything yet, the surprise is that tomorrow, tomorrow night, we are going to be going live with DJ, yep, LP, our locals, DJ LP and DJ Coolin from Pitas, California for the first time ever History making Cinco de Mayo fiesta. Quarantine, home, coronavirus, whatever you want to call it, party. So I have shared the flyer. So tomorrow we're going to be going live between six and nine. I would appreciate you guys' apoyo. You guys, please, please, please come on, share your. Oh, sorry. Share. Um, back us up with this one. This is going to be our first time. And your true old, <laughs> get out here. Your true, <laughs> your, I'm going to be actually the co host of this party. Yes, your girl, Yola Cocina, is going to be your co host for tomorrow's Cinco de Mayo Down in History party. So uh, remember you guys, get your bottles, get your margaritas, get your shots ready, come out and join us on live. I would appreciate each and every one of you guys. I really appreciate your support. You appreciate your support. I can't even talk. That's how excited I am. I was holding the secret all day long. I was holding the secret all day long. And I was like, I could not wait. And once again, I want to thank DJ Coolin and DJ LP for actually thinking of me. I really, really do appreciate this. And um, so here we go. So that was my surprise. So remember tomorrow, six to nine, you guys either log in under- Stay tuned. Uh, yes, yeah, stay tuned. And remember, YouTube, subscribe and like everybody. Thanks again. I really, really do appreciate and love each and every one of you guys. I'm so excited. So, lo que le estaba diciendo, la sorpresa, sorry you guys, I'm gonna go back and forth. So, la sorpresa, de mañana va a ser que vamos a ir en vivo con los DJs um, que viven aquí en esta área de Pittsburgh. Este, mañana de 6 a 9 vamos a hacer la primera vez en la historia de nuestras vidas. Vamos a tener una fiesta de 5 de mayo, pero en casa. So, agarran sus botellas, sus margaritas y vengan y celebran con nosotros por Facebook. Y este, allí les puse el flyer, allí siguen a los DJs que van a estar presente, este, y yo voy a ser una de sus um, servidoras, junto con mi amigo Saxton, um, allí les puse el flyer, síganos por el, por el Facebook, por el Instagram, por el YouTube, nos esperamos mañana, primeramente Dios, y hoy lo que vamos a hacer, le vamos a enseñar cómo marinar su carne para mañana, así es que ahorita tengo dos libras de carne asada, so I have two pounds of carne asada here. I'm so excited, you guys. I am so excited and so happy. I know I'm gonna be very, very, very nervous, but um, with you guys' support, you guys know this is gonna be my first time to ever do anything like this, to host a party like that. I'm, I'm a very good host here at home, but never on live like that, besides my videos. But, um, so I'm very excited. So please share, share the flyer, please. Share share my page, like my new page, uh, Yolas Cocina. Uh, my name is Yolanda Amaya, for those who don't know me. And once again, I appreciate your guys' support. And here we go. So, two pounds of carne asada. Hey, everybody. 
two pounds of carne asada. So the first thing you want to do is obviously wash your hands, which I already washed my hands. Really good. Plus we're gonna eat this ourselves, right? So then you're gonna you're gonna go ahead and wash your hands, and we're gonna put this to the side for just a minute, and you're gonna get one onion. Oops, one onion. Okay, and this is no, that one's not it. So one onion, and what we're gonna do is we're going to only use probably almost the whole thing, but probably most likely just a half because it's not that much meat. So. So let's go ahead and cut up our onions. Can you guys see me, you guys? Let me know. Si me pueden ver? So, tengo dos libras de carne. Dos libras de carne. Y una cebolla. Cebolla blanca. Y una chela. That's our ingredients. So, so far, our ingredients is going to be onions, um, cilantro. We have our uh, seasonings. I'll show you right now. So one of our seasonings is gonna be the seasoning salt, garlic salt. How coincidental, coincidence. I only had Corona in the refrigerator. Yes, Corona. So we have Corona, we're gonna be, we're gonna be uh, putting in Corona uh, cerveza, so beer, pepper, and limones, lime. All right, so here we go, you guys. So start cutting up your onion. So we're gonna have a half of an onion so far. I'm gonna see how much that's gonna make it. Let's see. Hey, hey, hey. All right, so here we go. You're gonna cut up your onions just like this. Can you guys see me? Let me know. Let me know if you can't see what I'm doing here. Hey, everybody who's just joining in. Oh yeah, okay. So here we go. So bear with me because you know I just had surgery recently and my hand is still, you know, the doctor says I still have to, you know, do a lot of practice with it and stuff. So it's getting a little better, but um, it's not fully there yet. So I'm just doing a little bit of time. So I'm gonna, we're gonna be cutting this half an onion. Johan, can you take that dog somewhere, please? By the way, I'm in my backyard because it's so nice out. Hey cousin, hi Cindy. Thank you so much, I really appreciate it. I really appreciate each and every one of you, I really do, I'm so excited, like, I'm just so excited for everything, I'm, goodness, God is great. All right, so, aquí tenemos una mitad de cebolla. All right, yo creo que ya, sí, suficiente. So, una mitad de cebolla, so a half an onion. We're gonna add that to our carne asada. To our meat. So let's add that first. And then, gonna kind of move it around. Bear with me, because my hands, I'm telling you, these hands are horrible right now. All right. All right, so now I'm gonna go in and I'm going to put some of our seasoning in there. So every time that I turn my um, my carne around, I'm gonna be adding a little bit of seasoning. Now, on the seasoning, there's really not a measurement. It's to taste, like I've told in many of my recipes. Some people like it saltier, some people like it spicy. Some, make it your own. I'm just telling you how we do it here at home. So we're gonna start with our seasoning salt. You know, just make sure you have enough for, to cover the whole thing. You're gonna put a little bit of that. You're gonna go in with your garlic salt, sal de ajo. Primero echamos, no sé si lo pueden ver, seasoning salt. Así se llama, seasoning salt. Y ahora vamos a agregar sal de ajo. Now, garlic salt gives taste a good taste to everything, you guys. We use this a lot in my household. We love us some garlic salt. So here we go, and then I'm gonna go in with the pepper. Once again, it's to your own discretion. Sal al gusto, ajo al gusto, pimienta al gusto. So, so far we have a half an onion, we cut up half an onion. We've added our seasoning salt, our garlic salt, and pepper. Okay, 
So now we're gonna turn this around and make sure that all of this meat gets the seasoning. And you guys see, oops. Okay, a mover la carne, a mover la carne. Para estar segura que todas las pedacitos de carne agarra las ingredientes que vamos a echar aquí. Okay, can you guys see this? All right, so you're gonna move it around. Okay, so now. Kids are so loud. All right, so now. I'm going to add cilantro. Cilantro. So I've I got a half of the cilantro, um, um, half of the cilantro bulk that I bought, and all I'm going to use is just the top part. I don't add in all this. I just use what it is, the leafing of it. So, so we're going to add some cilantro in there. We're going to move this around. That looks disgusting. I know. So we're going to add this around. I mean, we're going to move this around. Lo vamos a mover. So, eh, tengo, este, estoy agregando el cilantro. Una mitad de cilantro. Sorry, my Spanish is horrible, you guys. All right. So, ahí está. Ahora le voy a echar tantita más de las especias. So, I'm going to add a little bit more of the spices. So, here we go again. So, we have the salt, the seasoning salt, the garlic salt. And your pepper. All right. Now, once again. We're gonna move it around. A moverle, a moverle. Para que agarra todas las ingredientes que estamos echando aquí. So you wanna make sure you wanna move it around so you get all the seasoning. Please excuse my dog over there going crazy because he hears us all. All right, so see that? Looking good and it's smelling good. All right, so our next thing, I'm gonna put this to the side for just a minute. And our next thing we're gonna add is limones, lime. So I have four limones here. Hey, you guys, you guys are too loud. Four limones. And then, here we go. Hey, watch him that he's not gonna fall over there, please. All right, so we have four. I have all these kids over here. So I have the four lemons. Come on, por favor, por favor. All right, here we go. Okay. Now what we're gonna do? I have our professional little lemon squeezer here. I got this at the local uh, Mexican Supply no, it's not. store. So what you're gonna do is you're going to add. So son cuatro limones. Y vamos a agregar los cuatro limones. Primilos. All right, there we go. So, there we go. Hey, everybody. So we're here. Those who are just entering, um, coming on in. Uh, we're marinating our carne asada for tomorrow, Cinco de Mayo festivities. Our quarantine festivities. We're going to be live tomorrow, you guys, and I'm going to be the co-host of tomorrow's fiesta online. Isn't it exciting? Like, it's so crazy how things work. Once again, shout out to DJ LP and DJ Coolin for inviting us, myself and Sax, to be your guys' host. I can't wait. I'm so excited. I'm just so excited. Right? So, cuatro limones. Estamos primiendo cuatro limones. Acuérdense, mañana de seis a nueve. Vamos a estar live. Festejando cinco de mayo. Con los DJs. DJ LP y DJ Coolin. Vamos a tocar, tocar poquito de todo. We're going to play a little bit of everything, you guys. 
they're gonna not me but him them are gonna play some land music some old school hey calm down calm down latin music some regular r&b old school jennifer please get the kiss um old school how coincidental how coincidental that everybody comes when i'm doing my live are you kidding me hey cousin janelle how are you thank you for tuning in those are you who are just coming on remember i'm going to save this to my page so you guys uh, go back and look at what i'm doing here if you guys didn't catch us excuse me <laughs> excuse me these allergies are up the hook all right so son cuatro limones four limes hey everybody i know right all the kids all of a sudden now that i'm live they all show up making all kinds of noise hey please because no one's gonna be they're not gonna be able to hear me because of the dog too thank you all right so cuatro limones so here we are with four limes all right between four and five it's up to you if you wanted a little bit more you could add another one so i've added so far four limes so we've added a onion a half of an onion i've added cilantro salt i mean our uh, seasonings here we go these are seasoning salt garlic salt and pepper we all know what that is right pepper cilantro i have a half of a bulk of cilantro a bunch of cilantro excuse me and uh four limes so um aquí en la carne asada tenemos la cebolla mitad de una cebolla blanca y luego tenemos cilantro y este cuatro limones all right so now it's time for the corona where's the oh there it is can you undo it for me on the first? thank you so we're gonna add a half of the bottle of corona we're not gonna add all of it it's up to you guys if you guys want to but i'm just gonna add half of it so there you go there's your little secret ingredient ingredient is your half a bottle of corona and mix it all up and get all those juices all over oh this smells so good Okay, so echamos mitad de una corona, una botella de corona, cerveza. Y a moverle, a moverle, a moverle. So the kind of meat I got is carne asada and it was a, a chuck. It was a chuck. This one's a chuck and it's two pounds. I have two pounds of carne asada. Son dos libras de carne asada. Los que apenas están entrando, estamos marinando la carne para mañana para celebrar el 5 de mayo. Primeramente Dios. Tomorrow, you guys, 5 de mayo. This year we're going to make history. We probably will never have a 5 de mayo like this. I mean, maybe something similar, but never like this. A stay-at-home one. So, remember. So, and there you go. You just keep moving and making sure you have all your meat and the juices is here. Can you guys see that? And so it was two pounds of chuck carne asada. That's what it was called. And you just move it around. And then if you want it a little, if you want to add a little bit more, you want to add, you know, some different seasonings, that's up to you. You guys make it your own. But this is our way that we make our carne asada here at the Maya's house. So I really appreciate every one of you guys. This is how we marinated. This was easy. And um, so remember, stay tuned. Excuse me. Stay tuned for tomorrow. Mañana, primeramente Dios, vamos a estar en vivo de 6 a 8. Les puse el flyer um, allí en mi página, las dos páginas, la de Yol Yola uh, Cocina y la de Yolanda Maya. La, el flyer le va a decir a quién le va a seguir para poder vernos in vivo mañana, primeramente Dios. So I was telling them that I have already um, added the flyer to my page, uh, Yolas Cocina, and also Yolanda Amaya. So for those of you that uh, would like to come on with us tomorrow and party with us, bring your tequila, bring your margaritas, and we're gonna have a great time. I'm so excited because it's gonna be the first time ever I'm gonna be co-hosting a 
Cinco de Mayo Fest here in my own home in Pittsburgh, California. Who would have ever thought that? And here we go, you guys. So remember, go check out my page. I have a new YouTube, Yo Las Cocina. Subscribe and hit like. Also, hit that little bell so every time I go on, you guys will know, you guys will be notified that I have left a video or I'm going live, okay? As well as here on both of my pages on Facebook. Once again, I appreciate each and every one of you guys' support. Hola, Alejandra. I really appreciate it. Gracias for all of those who showed your love for just this one day so far that I've made my uh, YouTube page and my page on, my group page on Facebook. Again, I appreciate it. Share, share, share. Like, like, like everybody. And I will continue to shine light on this feed as long as God willing. And he continues, uh, continues to allow me to do this because I'm really enjoying it. I'm totally a host. I love hosting parties at my home. And I love to come and share it with you guys. I really do appreciate each and every one of you guys. So tomorrow, don't forget, tomorrow, 8 o'clock, 6 o'clock, excuse me, 6 to... Nine, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, six to nine. Sorry, six to nine tomorrow. Watch out for the live with DJ Coolin and DJ LP. Once again, thank you guys for inviting us. It's gonna be me and Saxton um, co-hosting uh, our Cinco de Mayo going down in history coronavirus party. So stay tuned. Can't wait. Thanks so much. Thanks, Kim. I appreciate it. And go share. Have a great night. God bless. Bye.